Hi, I'm Katie and welcome to Cooking with Cardin Children's and today we're going to be making crepes. This is one of my favorite meals. Now, to start off, we're going to want to take one cup of flour and get it in there. Just kind of sift it around. Okay, and put it in here. Okay, and now you're going to want to take two eggs and throw it right in the sink here. Okay, good. And now you're going to want to whisk it together. Real nice. Get all the flour mixed up with the egg. And now as we're whisking, you want to add, slowly you want to add a half a cup of water. Get it. Half a cup. And just slowly, while you're whisking. <laughs> okay, put some in there. Whisk away. Add some more water while you're going. Now, breakfast is one of the most important meals of the day. It's my favorite, I can't leave home without it. And um, yeah, and this is a great way to just get some fruits in there and have a nice, really light crepe. It's better than pancakes. Okay, add the rest of the water. And now after the water is all mixed in, you're gonna wanna add a half a cup of milk. So, let's get the milk poured in here. Add half a cup, you can kinda just eyeball it. Okay, good. Slowly add some milk in. You don't want it to get too liquidy at first, so I'm gonna kinda mix that in there. Just whisk it. Okay. And so we've, we have some butter in the microwave and it's all melted and once I get this all mixed in there, I'm gonna add some melted butter. Just two tablespoons is all you need to get it nice. You can see the batter there? It's nice and thin, which is what we want. Now, take the butter and just pour it in there. This will give it a really rich, rich taste. So, okay, and the last ingredient you want to add is salt. You want to take a fourth a teaspoon of salt, give it a well-rounded flavor. Okay, I just add that in there. Okay, once you've whisked it all together, you've got this really nice, nice batter. Take a look at that. And now you're ready to cook on the stove. Okay, so we've got the stove already turned on, uh, about a little less than medium heat, and it's very hot, so you wanna make sure you have a parent's permission or have a parent there with you to help you with the stove. And so you're gonna wanna take some Pam and just give it a nice coating. Whisk this a little bit, and now pour a thin layer, just enough so that you can spread it around to the sides. Now you're gonna wanna move it around the pan. Okay. Make sure it's very thin, because it's what crepes are, they're just thin pancakes. Okay, so once we've got that on there, you wanna let it cook through. And the indication you, you get is the sides start curling up a little bit, and it starts to turn a bit clearer on the side, as you can already start, see it starting right there. Just make sure you're always safe around the stove. Okay, this is just about done. You wanna check it with your fork. It should come right off. Okay, you have to wanna put your fork underneath and just flip it over, get it nice in there. You can see it's very, very light, nice and uh, whitish almost. And uh, it's great for putting almost any kind of dish on it. You can put fruits like we're going to do, or you can have dinner meals or, or vegetables or about anything you want on there. It's really good. It's good for anything. And um, so you want to always make sure before you're using your crepes that you have a lot of pan. You want to make sure it's just quick, easy on, easy off. And um, yeah, so here looks about done. You want to check it. Just make sure that it's not squishy. And it's very nice. Okay, so you're gonna take your fork here, just pull it up from the edge, flip it on. Flip it on. Okay, and we're gonna wanna come over here and start putting all the fruits on. Okay, now we're ready to fill our crepes. So we have Nutella, 
always great. So you're going to want to take some Nutella and spread that on there. Nice. Thick layer of Nutella because it's delicious. Okay. Now, just put this over to the side here. And, okay, so we're going to cut up some strawberries. You always want to make sure you have a pair of guardian to help you with this because, yeah, they're knives and they're sharp. Okay, so we got three strawberries here. We're just going to spread some around in here. And we also have blueberries. Okay, we're going to take a handful of blueberries and put that on there. Okay. And this is just delicious. It's like my favorite breakfast meal. Just roll it up. Side, just roll it up. Okay. And you've got a nice crepe. Just put them to the side because it looks pretty. Mmm. It's delicious.